Hi, Jeff here with Corsair. I'm going to give you an intro to the Hydro Series HG10 GPU bracket. The HG10 allows you to use any Corsair Hydro Series liquid CPU cooler to provide the same efficient liquid cooling performance to your graphics card. If you've recently upgraded your Hydro Series cooler to a newer model, it's a great way to reuse your old one to improve your graphics card's performance. Once the bracket is installed on the card, you'll attach the CPU cooler just like you would attach it to a CPU, except you're going to use the hardware that comes with the HG10. Now that I've got everything attached to our graphics card, we're going to install the graphics card and connect our radiator and fans to the system. Reference graphics cards use a blower style fan for cooling. This fan is thermally controlled by your GPU temperature. The HG10 reuses this fan to cool the VRAM and VRMs, but uses a Hydro Series cooler to cool the GPU itself. Once the GPU is being liquid cooled, the fan will run much more quietly, providing just enough airflow to effectively cool the HG10, which acts as a giant aluminum heatsink for your graphics memory and voltage regulation modules. And now this system has two liquid cooling units, a Hydro Series H100i for the CPU and an H75 attached to the HG10 to cool the GPU. I've upgraded from the original fans to SP120 LED fans, but the original fans that came with your Hydro Series liquid CPU cooler will work fine as well. The HG10 is compatible with any of Corsair's Hydro Series liquid CPU coolers. It's meant for reference GPUs, but will work with some aftermarket designs as well. For a full compatibility list, check out our website. And if you'd like more information on how to attach the HG10 to your graphics card, we've got a detailed installation video for you. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, here's how to reach us.